This is a very quick run through on the main features and setup for the VMAID C5 set top box. Uh, the, this is the front and back panel of the set top box. Just a note that the remote control is uh, very important. Uh, make sure you don't lose it because it's very hard to uh, operate or at least install this box without it. The dimensions are pretty standard for this uh, type of box today and the rear panel is shown. It has two RF inputs for antennas. One is for terrestrial and the other is for satellite. There's HDMI output, a USB port for recording uh, signals on uh, USB sticks, uh, analog audio and video out and DC 12 volts in very handy with a power switch. This is the installation uh, screen when you first switch it on or when you do a factory default. Select uh, the time zone uh, is what I suggest you do and um, go to the installation screen by typing 000 on the remote control. Select DVB-T2. You must have a suitable antenna attached to the uh, connector at the rear of the box on the ANT connector. Make sure the country is set to Australia. and uh, auto scan to scan for free to wear television and radio stations. This will take three to four minutes to complete depending on your antenna and location. I've zapped it along a bit here. At the end of the search you're asked whether you want to save the data. Uh, you now have the TV, free to wear TV and radio stations. To select, uh, to program the, uh, or to receive the ATV repeater, go in back to the DVB-T2 uh, menu and select channel 21. Go down to the frequency, select that, and put in 445500, which is the frequency of the RTV repeater. Make sure the bandwidth is set to 7 MHz and start the search. After a very brief time, if you've got a reception, you will get RTV 1 and 2. Notice the uh, signal and quality sig levels at the back, at bottom of the screen. To program a local uh, S transmitter such as your ATV transmitter you I the way I do it there's a number of ways you can do it the way I do it is uh, create a new satellite call it uh, what you like uh, I selected uh, in this example capital A capital A capital A and notice that the keyboard screen at the bottom uh, at the bottom of this keyboard screen that has uh, color functions which are different from the the next row of color functions. Create just the new satellite and confirm uh, that in the satellite list. I then go to antenna settings. Uh, and select the new satellite, in this case AAA. I set, accept most of the um, defaults, but you can change 22 kilohertz, uh, you can turn that off. I do turn LNB power off uh, as a matter of course. Then uh, do the satellite search using the red button on the remote control.
and after a few seconds you should see in this blind search the two uh, channels, multiplex channels on uh, uh, no, in this case, sorry, it's not multiplexed. It's only the single channel of your local transmitter. Save, uh, save that setting. And uh, you've now programmed your local uh, transmitter.